Hey, welcome back, everybody. Sign here again with another episode of Chicken Block. They are deeply discussing something, aren't they? And yeah, great. My audio mix just popped up the nag screen. All right, that's always fun. All right, and it's my audio mixer is donationware, but I have donated, but it doesn't remember that I've donated. So it keeps popping up with this wonderful nag screen. Reminding me to donate when I already have. Granted, it's been a few years, but. So, um, yes. Diamond. Diamond Dimension. Uh, what else can we sell here? Uh, well, yeah. I need diamond chickens to, to progress, so to speak. There we go. And you. I need six blocks of diamonds. And I need two blocks of diamond wood. Oh, I need to go grab my fun stuff, my explody bits. Uh, let's see. You, you can stay put. Uh, okay, I do have my flint and steel on me still. Okay, good. I have yet to eat one of these, actually. Probably should try that out. Also, all my chickens are now 10, 10, 10. <laughs> yeah. And whoop, there we go. I did manage to get some gravitite from the ether, right? So I have a gravitite pickaxe now. Thought about making a diamond one, which I could definitely do now, uh, but vanilla tools don't work as well in the aether dimension. So, oh my God, look at the damage that did to me. What do you give me? You give me regeneration. Oh, nice. Okay, cool. So it's kind of like a golden apple. I cannot eat it while I'm not hungry, though. That did a stupid amount of damage, though. And that's through regular Zaynite. Uh, once I get Gravitite, then I'm thinking about making a suit of Gravitite armor. I still actually got hit by the explosion from that far away. Yeah, this stuff is insane. I want to actually make some diamond explosives. All right. So we are... Oh my god, that's a lot of diamonds. Okay. I need to make more of these. I mean, it's just blueberries, eggs, oats, and sugar. So... And... I did do some enchanting. Okay, we got strays. Great. Oh my god. Go away, guys. Strays and drowned. I need like a teleportation staff or something. Ow. Look, go the hell away. Nobody likes you, strays. You smell funny, and you're annoying. Run away. Ow. I need something with step assist in this pack. All right, and it was over here-ish, right? Oh, I need freaking ah! Ah! Oh, hey! Just noticed he dropped a trident. Seriously, it dropped a baked potato because he was on fire when he died. Okay, there's the portal. Ah, nope. You know what? We're going here for now. I need... Ah! Nope. Go away. All right. Well, we'll save 
that for now. I need to just pitch those. Let's go ahead and get you made up. Get rid of the extra one. And I left you here. Also, I don't really need bones. Bone meal is not hard to get. Let's sleep through the rain. Excuse you for pushing me around. You know what? I'm just going to turn all these into blocks because that's a lot of diamonds that I need to do something with. You to you. Boom. There we go. We're going to go you, and there's our netherite igniter. Now, the downside is I need 10 blocks of netherite. So, let me find my gunpowder. Uh, there's two of it there. Do I not have any more gunpowder? I think I actually might have deleted it. Because I didn't need it, so... Um, right. You instead search for creeper chickens. There you guys are. Turn that off. There we go. Uh, let's see. Okay. I wish I gave an idea on the tooltip as to, like, how powerful it was. Hey, look, we're already getting gunpowder, and we got enough. All right, I'm going to go ahead and stock up a little bit for now. Yeah, it's really strange. These do not show up in EMI at all. No, they do through if you look up gunpowder. But, yeah, if I look up, say, TNT, nada. All right, well, you come that done. Now, I can turn these into diamond dust. Okay, and after this one, it doesn't work. Gotcha. Well, you can go away. Um, you know, let me look up. And... Yeah, there's emerald. Does emerald dust do anything? It does. Emerald actually makes tools. Nine attack damage. Well, that can be good. The same as a diamond axe on a sword. All right, we'll get that there. We're gonna leave the netherite igniter behind just in case things go really south. And I can't get my corpse back for whatever reason. Okay, let me get hungry again here. There we go. But yeah, I did some mob farming all the way back in the coal dimension, because it's probably the safest place. All right, I want to go get that trident now. Where the... It was over this way, right? Oh, dang it. Probably this jerk over here. Not him, but... This guy. Picked it up. Or it might be, ow, him. There we go, got it. Do, 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 do. Being shot at. Don't particularly care for it. Run. <laughs> I have no idea how big this is going to be, but I am a little bit worried about it. Oh, damn. Uh, yeah. Um, if you absolutely want to just destroy an area, Diamond TNT. Another is probably going to be even worse, to be completely honest, but, uh. Wow. That was one TNT. Oh, crap. I fell in the hole. Oh, there's another cave down here. Okay, I don't need that. Dirt's fine. No. 
killed him. Browned. I think he burned to death before I actually killed him, though. All right, I'm going to go up, up, there we go. So now I have to cut down trees. Hey, you? You need to just die. Man, strays are annoying. Alright, I need, like, a log cutting mod of some kind. Or excavation should be great right about now. Of course he had to set me on fire. Go away. Okay, we're good for now. It's daytime, so the spiders aren't really going to be aggroed on me too badly. Huh, that skeleton forgot about me. Cool. Oh, hello. And it seems like logs being broken by explosions do not spawn chickens. Yeah, this is just the way to do it. You just completely pass by an, inner, an area. And... You do have occasional guys showing up, but it's usually not all that bad. Oh, I say usually not that bad. Where the hell are you? Oh, there you are. Drowned with a uh, freaking trident. This guy's hurt. You know, I have an experiment I want to do. Give me some of these logs. Let me get back to the portal. Yeah, let me grab some more of these. Hello. All right, we got this nice peaceful area now. Let me go ahead and get rid of some stuff. Is this is just yeah, bone meal. Okay. And I can get rid of that, and then we will use this. I'm curious. Does the game differentiate between placed logs or naturally grown ones? Well, it died. <laughs> because it spawned inside of a block, but diamond chickens, or well, at least diamond chickens, I'm guessing all chickens, can actually spawn whenever you break a block that you've placed. Also, I have two tridents now. That's kind of cool. And a nautilus shell. What am I going to do with you? I have no idea. Uh, but yeah. So I got the quest done for the diamond chicken. 
because I looked at it before it died. But uh, I'm not sure what the drop rate is. I was digging through the, the configs of it, and uh, I didn't see exactly how these are being spawned in. I'm guessing it's the in control mod, but I didn't see any references there. But, uh... Alright, got another one. You... Don't be running away now. I, it's actually, I was looking through the configs again. It's listed in the in control uh, configs for uh, events. I, I knew you guys be out here waiting for me. Just one, though, huh? Go away. And it's a it's a one percent drop rate. So, honestly, if you grab some logs, hold yourself up somewhere. It's probably the easiest way to get these guys. There we go. You got half a heart down. That's fine. Now let's look up diamond chicken, right? Uh, let's go ahead and spell it correctly this time. There we go. Uh, diamond chicken and crossbreeding is just with pink dye for the gravitite or chicken. Okay. Why are you? Why are you sparkly? Weird. Okay. Uh, pink. There we go. And we drop that off. And get that back where it belongs. Well, we have another diamond chicken now. That's fine here. You know what? You go there and raise. And I have to wait for you. I could probably force feed you down to less than 300 seconds, right? Yeah, that's like a minute now. Seeds. main thing my copper coin chickens are being used for right now is seeds. You come here. Go ahead and run away all you want. Alright, I do not need pink dye. There we go. So 15 seconds and I can crossbreed these guys again. All right, cool. There we go. And... No diamond chicken. Dang it. You come here then. <laughs> uh, do we need diamond chicken spawn eggs for anything? Not really. Okay. You can sit over here and time out with the other guy. This is why having tons and tons of seeds is such a nice thing to have. Okay. 30 seconds, I guess, about as low as I can get it to go. That's fine. Oh, hey, I got a piece of copper. Nice. Got that from the drowned, I guess. Come on, guys, just give me a gravitate, would you? Come on. Hey, we got one. Sweet. All right, so yeah, chicken guide. There's my diamond and gravitate chicken. Great, now I can put you away, so you quit pooping pink dye everywhere. I can breed these two together. And those two together. Alright, away you go. You go there. Yeah, you know, here. We got two copper coins for that in there. Scrambled realities, gravitate ore. And then enchanted gravitate. You just drop gravitate ore in your enchanter. And... Oh, it's required to harvest amber from Skywood. Okay, yeah. Amber Skywood logs, because we need the golden amber as well. Uh, we got a golden air cloud chicken. We got the luminescence chicken in the past. And the brass. Quartz. Gold. Emerald. And diamond. And I've, I've got 
the uh, the igniter at least. Dimension pool of ancient debris as predicted. This one is going to be problematic because if it's ancient debris, that stuff's immune to explosions. <laughs> Although I don't know, maybe I should get another uh, diamond TNT and. Uh, yeah, diamond TNT shouldn't be too. Like, oh, I could get some iron, but uh, the diamond shouldn't be all that good. You know, all that hard to get. Um, either that, or I'm going to actually have to invest in somehow getting my hands on a silk touch pick. I could do that pretty easily, actually. Well, I could try for it pretty easily. Let's put it that way. I've got some experience right now, so I might as well give it a try and oh, it's a freaking silk touch pick. Okay, sweet. Oh, that worked out. Why are you guys like so sparkly and not sleeping? What happened to you? Man, I have no idea what happened to these guys. Hmm. Oh, well. Hey, uh, you guys ready to breed yet? Hmm. A minute or a hundred seconds on that one. Oh, yeah. I probably should have uh, slipped into the gills with seeds. What's your cooldown? 150? Okay. Here we go. And so we got our Gravitite now. Gravitite chickens. We can get alchemical coal chickens from Gravitite. Okay. And then alchemical coal can go to experience the honey chicken. Honey is slime. Okay. Now we're actually getting to the point, too, where I'm going to require crushing wheels. So, let me get my brass chickens out. I should have done this a while ago, actually. So that way I would have a stockpile of brass by now. Um, in here? Yep, there we go. Um, doo -doo 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 -doo. I'm just thinking I'm probably good on, well, maybe not, because I haven't been in this dimension all that much, 57, yeah, that's probably good enough. How many feathers do we have stocked up? 321. I do need to put a void upgrade into that eventually. Hello, creeper chicken. Thank you. And we'll just put you right there. And I still have no idea why my villagers are just being weird like that. They just are. Did I just... Oh, diamond nuggets. Nine of these equal a diamond. Okay. Second, are they okay? They're no longer on mating cooldown. All right, cool. Three hundred, and then I can shove a bunch of seeds down your throat. All right, sweet. All right, come on. And we get another Gravitite. Sweet. So we have our two Gravitites now. And we will consign him to the Void. You know what? You too. He needs a friend down there. Alright, and then the Gravitite, it was uh, with Cole, right? Yeah, we're just going to delete that one. Uh, gravitate chicken. You always was just with coal. Okay. Cool. All right. I think we're good for the moment. All right. So we have our diamond and gravitate chickens. Hello. 
uh, up to 10, 10, 10. Also, I have a full suit of Gravitite armor, including the gloves. And that makes it so that's my jump now. But the double jump is just ridiculously not there. And our alchemical coal chickens are doing pretty good. So there are two routes I can go on at this point. One is I can make the crushing wheels. Haha, <laughs> you're still stuck, you jerk. And the other is I can go back to the uh, aether. Hey, cool. Eight coins. And I need nine for that, though. It shouldn't take too much longer. Uh, I know where at least a silver dungeon is. So I'll go back to Scrambled Realities. Uh, this one here. Home of the Valkyries. And I, I know exactly where one of those is. And depending on this one, there may be a gold dungeon right next to this. Because there's like this giant tower. Like the next island over from the silver dungeon. If that's the case, that's sweet. Uh, also, I got Silk Touch, but it's not in a book, so... So I'm not going to worry about that quest. But I need to get these two done to unlock the Platinum Dungeon and also the Sun Altar. That way we can make this thing. Honestly, instead of this quest leading to the Elite Crafting Table... Oh, I still need to get Stratus as well. It should be the Sun Altar quest leading to that. Also, okay, Stratus, what is up with you? Ah, I need Chromatic Air Clouds. Okay. So I'm thinking Jetpack. Sounds like a really good idea here soon. Uh, we're up to 48 brass ingots. That's not terrible. Uh, let's see. Uh, I think iron was here. Yes. And I'm pretty sure it was over here for the andesite casings. And it was just a uh, a shaft, right? Oh, okay. I brings up your aether thing. Okay. Uh, mechanical press is yeah, just a shaft. Okay, so give me uh, give me two of those, would you? And then we'll come over here and we'll grab this wonderful plank because I'm gonna make a cog. And go ahead and make ourselves another mechanical press. I've got depots in one of these. Yep, here we go. Uh, coal chickens. Okay, they're ready to breed. Hello. It's going to take a long, long time to get used to that. All right. Baby pops out. One minute. Close enough. And I'm going to... Come over here. If I can, safely anyway. <laughs> you know what? Let's do it this way. And, you know, it's just for temporary reasons. Uh, we are going to grab ourselves a wooden hopper. I'm going to place that there. Just so it collects items. Now, if I come over to here, I can just throw this out. And hey, look, brass sheets. All right, I'll come back to that later. Uh, let's see. Four seconds. Okay. Time that just about right. I see you, chicken. And that's a 10 10 10. That's a 10 10 10. I just need to wait for this guy to grow up now. Let me speed that up a little bit. You get enough seeds, you can get it down to, you know, quite low. Uh, it stops accepting seeds when it's at 10 seconds or less. Go. Now, I will need to crossbreed with the alchemical coal chickens later, but uh, that was the junky one. 10 and 10. Okay. And I've got a bunch of dripstone chicken spawn eggs because these guys just never quit spawning. Also, we've got tropical fish on our pool for right now. As soon as an axolotl spawns in, there's another one of these stupid chickens. Go away. They're everywhere. Alright, I don't need that or that. So I have a pulse of gravitite. I have the gravitite axe, which was required to get amber. 
which I believe was also needed for Stratus, right? Yes. So maybe I should be looking at making Jetpack. Right, so I'm going to need energy cells, which means I need basic coils, which basic coils are... Wow, okay. If I get to the ultimate ingots, I can actually make a creative jetpack. Oh, that's kind of cool. Uh, so basic coils are used for wood and stone tier. Advanced coil is used for iron and gold. Elite is used for diamond and emerald. I can actually get up to emerald now that I have access to diamonds. All right, so let's look at our... Uh, would check pack first this guy. You stop. I'm up to 14. I just need like 9,000 something more. For one singularity. I don't know how many of those singularities I'm going to need either. That's going to be fun to get. All right. So, wood check pack. All right. I need. Leather strap. Do I need the strap for any further ones? Doesn't look like it. Okay. Do I have leather laying around still? Or do I use it all up? I mean, I've got leather chicken, so that's obviously not an issue. Alright. I've got two leather. I need three. Really? Oh, rabbit hide's about it. Isn't there? Yeah, there is a milling. Okay, I don't have either of those. Hmm. Dang. But oh, maybe over here? Yes, I actually have a good amount of leather. Okay, cool. I need iron nuggets, which unfortunately I don't think I have anymore. I think I threw them out because like, oh, I don't need these anymore. Well, that was wrong, wasn't it? So it was like that, that, and there's our leather strap. I need two, pl or I need four planks. I need a wood capacitor and then a thruster. So I need five of these energy cells. That's five. 11 basic coils. That is a lot of iron redstone. And I might build with that later, so I'll just give me some of this. So it's like 11 of these things. At least they stack. I mean, that is a plus, right? I mean, at least they stack. And... I have to do the math again now. Three... Five. Five energy cells. I need a battery. I need a couple furnaces. Okay, now this is going to be the annoying part because I think I threw all my cobble away. Actually, I know I did. I'm like, I will just pop these birds out later if I need it. But guess what? We need it. Uh, that's tough. That's cobblestone. Okay. Okay, hello. I always forget about that. Now, here's a question. I need furnaces the whole way down. Okay. What was this last year? Netherite? Another right is an upgrade of the emerald. Okay. So you guys need to get busy. So how are we doing here? Oh hey, look at that. Cool. Back to the shop. There's that. I was gonna want one want one of these. And hmm, that's an idea now, isn't it? And now I have a couple of budding amethysts as well. Which seems I can just buy them in the future if I need them. I'm just going to do that. I can move them later if they get in the way, what have you. I don't care. Alright, and... Our brass plates are done. Or brass, brass sheets. Because create has to be difficult. And name things differently than everybody else. Oh, it's a bedtime already, guys? Yeah. 
Right, so it was furnaces I needed. All right, cobblestone time. How much we got? 12. That's enough for one. Okay. Come on, guys. Who got some more cobblestone for me, would you? You know, I really do feel sorry for the chickens that actually, you know, lay full blocks instead of an item <laughs> or an egg. I mean, eggs don't have corners. Cubes do. And I went ahead and had this thing. I edited the filters to make sure that brass gets compacted as well. Okay, well, that's my two furnaces I need for right now. <laughs> you best be running away, chicken. See that? He just like pooped a bunch of crap out on the ground there. All right. Wood thrusters go. Battery. So I just need four more planks now. Okay. Jetpack. Quest complete. And I believe that's for the beginnings. Yes. Oh, dang it. Now I gotta get... To be able to charge this, I have to go through all of this stuff here. Okay. Well, I am going to concentrate on getting myself up to an emerald jetpack. But in the meantime, I am going to go ahead and call this an episode. My god, the jump. Eee. But it seems to be I'm basically immune to fall damage, which is kind of handy. It doesn't actually tell you anywhere what the uh, the set bonus is, which is kind of unfortunate. Is there anything else I can make a gravitate? Uh, we can make smithing templates. Okay, gravitate gloves, a ring. I have no idea what it does. There is, like, a lore book, right? Yeah. Book of lore. Oh, that's not very handy at all. Uh, let me pull my boots off, then. And, hey, look, we can jump normally now. Okay, when the full set is worn, you get an extra high jump. Okay. That... Okay, that makes sense, I guess. Uh, let me... No, not you. You, right? Because I have a Zaynite ring here. Allows you to mine faster. Okay. I kind of figured it... That's what it used to be. Because I remember them being really awesome and they just... They would break all the time. That wasn't like 1710 though. That was like Ozone 2, which I haven't played in forever. Uh, but I am going to go ahead and call this an episode. It's going to take a while for me to grind up to the top tier jet... Well, second to top tier jetpack, tier 5. There's 6 and then there's actually tier 7, which is creative. But we're... Uh, we don't have access to that act yet, so... Uh, next time, I'll get this set up. Uh, this is not going to be hard. It's I just need seven of each of these. And we can make the mechanical crafters, and then we can get that set up and ready to go. How much stress? Use 256. You're producing, like, 2048. So I might be able to actually... No, I should make dedicated windmill just for the grindstone, I think. And we have budding amethyst. This is going to take a while to produce anything. That's fine. If I'm really in a hurry, I can just pop out some luminite chickens. Get a bunch of, or not luminite, um, ambrosia or chickens. Hey, look, more cobblestone. Good. I'm going to need a lot of that. Because I've got to make, like, eight more furnaces. It's only a stack of cobble, though. But thank you for coming out. I hope you enjoyed this episode. And until the next one, sign signing out. Have fun.